leveraging combinatorial testing for safety critical computer vision datasets. This is collaborative work of Christoph Gladisch, Christian Heinzelmann, Martin Herrmann, and Matthias Wörle from corporate research Robert Bosch GmbH. Testing of perception functions is a challenge, particularly in a safety relevant setting such as automated driving. The domain of computer vision is an open context, the reality, with nearly endless possibilities. The input space of all images is enormous. How can we design test sets that support our confidence in the correct behavior of a computer vision function? Computer vision functions are typically evaluated using statistical methods, which create an aggregate result for all images. Here we take a verification perspective where each individual test is important. It should be mentioned that these approaches, statistical and verification, do not exclude each other, but should be seen as complementary. However, the two approaches are pursued by separate communities. With this paper, we would like to draw attention to inputs domain design and combinatorial testing for the purpose of designing and analyzing computer vision datasets. A scenario of NCAP vulnerable road users protection tests serves to demonstrate our approach. We address two challenges. First, our approach addresses the problem how to frame the open context of computer vision into a finite domain model as shown on the right. The domain model is a finite vocabulary consisting of dimensions and possible choices for each dimension. It helps to obtain a controllable and manageable state space and to define a test end criterion. A concrete test like the image on the left is described by a combination of values for each dimension. Note, when using the approach for training a neural network or for evaluation using statistical approaches, then one abstract test can correspond to a set of concrete tests. An important aspect of our approach is methodological support for model management. It allows domain model experts to work collaboratively on domain models and to update them iteratively. The second challenge is how to create a set of abstract tests of a computational feasible size. We suggest combinatorial testing, which has proven to be an effective testing method in various domains. Combinatorial testing does not explore the whole combinatorial space of all dimensions, but only the whole combinatorial space for subsets of dimensions. This results in a significant reduction of tests. For example, the full combinatorial test space in this example is 11,520 and 9,216 with constraints. The full pairwise combinatorial coverage for this example can be achieved with 21 abstract tests. Some results in conclusion. Using our approach, we have analyzed the pairwise coverage for the cityscapes and AEV datasets. Furthermore, we have computed missing combinations in these tests and showed how to update the test sets to achieve full pairwise coverage. The synthesis of these techniques from separate communities into an overall workflow that provides incremental generation of tests with formal guarantees provides a novel approach for coverage guarantees in datasets. We would like to thank the German Federal Ministry for Economic Affairs and Energy and the project AI Safeguarding for supporting this work.